Hello friends, welcome to lecture number 13 that is inserting images in the power director video. So in this particular lecture you will see how to insert the images as well as add the transition effects then how to create the slideshows as well. So over here we have got this power director open and then I'm just gonna delete this one. So to insert the image what you have to do is uh, go to your media room and over there you will have a lot of images so what you do you just drag and drop it on the track like this and if you want to add another image then what you will have to do is import another image like this then go to pictures or wherever that particular pictures are available say this one and then what you have to do is you have to drag it as well if you want to add that one like that and that is how you can insert the images you can also insert the images uh, between the video clips as well like for example this is one video clip and this is another video clip in the track number one and you can also add the image over there in that track like this one like that you can override as well you can if you want you can insert that one as well so that is how you can insert the images now to add the effect like transition effects is pretty much same as you uh, have we added the effects on the video you have to go to this effect or the transition room and then you can select any effect uh, that you want to add transition you want to add like this and if i run it now so as you can see that effect was added to that particular clip or the image now this is about adding the effects next thing that I want to show you is that how to create the slide shows so these are the two images over there and let us say I want to create the slide show then what you have to do is select the images and then click on slide show and there are some templates over there you can also add the background music if you want then there is a slide show preferences as well and there are different different templates that you can use so let us say you want to use the 3d template then click on that and then next then it will create the slide show out of those two images and then if you want to preview that you can preview it as well over here as you can see those two images are being displayed in the slide show if you want to change it if you are, if you are not happy with this particular slide show you can click on previous and then select a different template or the style then click on next and then again you can view that preview that particular template how it looks like this one is pretty stylish like that you can create the slide shows and uh, then if you're happy with that you can click on next then you can produce the video create this or you can click on advanced editing <coughs> or you can click on advanced editing to replace these images with the slide show then you can click on ok and uh, these images will be replaced by the slide show that we just created you can also preview it like that so that is how you can uh, work with images and uh, create the slide shows in the power director so let us import this add these images once again to see what other operations we can do with images so once you select the image you can see that there are a lot of buttons that appear over here 
so you can crop the image by clicking on this button then you can uh, set the duration as well then time info add text or remark timestamp etc as well so you can add the remarks as well on the photo overlay format can also be set and then click on ok that's how you can preview it and there is also tools power tools blending effects you can fix and enhance to change the brightness or a lot of operations you can do like lighting adjustment if you want to do then if you want to add the lens correction remove red eyes you can do the color adjustment as well like you can change the brightness like that you can also adjust the exposure as well so like that you can edit the images as well right here in the power director to apply you can click on apply to all you can also reset as well and you can also click on this cross button to uh, get rid of that window so that is how you can do various operations on the images in the power director Thanks for attending this lecture.